What's good guys? I'm John the Chief and for this video it's gonna be on how to get the chainsaw within Fallout 76. I am really excited to show you guys exactly how to get this weapon. This is one of the brand new weapons they actually added within the game since Fallout 4 and is actually really cool. Unfortunately though I don't really think it's that great of a weapon. It just looks really cool and it's fun to play around with. Alright, so before I actually get any further into the video, it would mean a lot to me if you guys could like the video and also subscribe to the channel. It greatly appreciate it and also it really does help me out a lot. Okay, so let's get right on into it. First things first, you're going to want to go to the mountainside bed and breakfast. Now I know I pointed out this area in a past video, but this is actually where you can get the chainsaw every single time. except. If you already looted the place then you'll have to wait like a day or two in order to actually for the chainsaw to respawn so you can loot it again so what you want to do is that you want to fight through all the scorched enemies or the mire work enemies or the mole miners or the pharaohs whatever set of enemies that they actually have in here and you want to make your way to the bottom floor the bottom floor will always have a chainsaw right on this set of shelves uh, as you can see right here this is where it is now if you want to see where to uh, actually go in order to get it this is actually a run after i cleared the entire area and then go into the house in order to actually pick up the chainsaw so you guys can actually see exactly where to pick it up now for fighting with it i actually don't recommend using it that much to be honest i find it rather weak compared to other melee weapons that you'll be using Though it is only level 20, the one that you will find here. I haven't found a consistent place to actually get chainsaws for a higher level, but maybe if it was like set for level 50 or 45, like other max tier weapons, it would actually be stronger. But it doesn't even do what you would expect the chainsaws to do, which is cut off the limbs and make them useless for the opponent. I was expecting when I would use the chainsaw for the arms to get cut off the scorched or the uh, Yao Guais, but unfortunately it doesn't really do that. It doesn't cripple them like I thought it would, which is what I was expecting to happen like in Fallout 4. If I used an explosive on a death call, his limbs fell off and he couldn't do anything. I was hoping that something similar would happen if I used the chainsaw on the limbs of the opponents. But that wasn't happening. It did do a consistent amount of damage, but I feel like other melee type of weapons are better just because the chainsaw has a really long cast time. It does get interrupted and staggered, which makes you have to use it again. And also, it doesn't do large bursts of damage. It does really fast ticks of damage, which actually makes it so I feel like it has a longer time to kill than most weapons. Anyways, that's it for the video guys. Hope all of you guys enjoy. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoy it. Tell me, what do you guys think of the chainsaw? Do you think this is a weapon that you'll be using throughout your time in Fallout 76? And yeah, that's basically it. Hope all of you guys enjoy the video, and have a great day.